What? Hello Momento, I'm Sarah from 190. Today I'd like to show you guys a floating block in the sky. It leaves shadows. If I was to break this block, the shadow never goes away. But how did I do How did I do that? That's gravel and sand right there, floating in the air. As you can see, it's everywhere. The shadow won't go away. Why won't it go away? Chaps, I'm back! Simply because this is my channel, and where else would I be? Hey guys, look at these shadows, they just won't go away. They just won't go. And that's cool, because now you can place your own shadows anywhere. So guys, what you want to do is get out some ice blocks, some glowstone. If you want to know how this works, follow me. All you need is some lily pads, and ice blocks, and gravel and sand. So you place the, the ice as high as you wish, and Put the glowstone down until it melts. Once it melts, simply get rid of all of the uh, all of the glowstone, like so, and put a fucking lily. <laughs> pad on the top. Okay, there we go. Excellent. All right, so you can see now that it's updated the water, which is quite bizarre, if not crazy, just a little. So now I'm putting the gravel on the top, with sand also, to the point in which gravity just doesn't give a shit. I once knew a little lady called Lily, which reminds me I need to get her some pads. So now you can get rid of taking away the water block, and the pad, the lily pad. And you can see the ice has gone, everything's gone, bar the floating blocks, which is gravel and sand. This is really cool because you can actually make a bridge out of the same idea. First I've made an ice bridge like so. Okay, um, what was I say? Okay, so we have glowstone melting the ice away. And as it melts, as you can see, I am now placing the lilies on top of the water. You can do this on the steps or on the bridge itself, like so. This is amazing. Just amazing! It shouldn't be happening. As you can see, I'm getting rid of the glowstone and I have a lily, a lily place here for my blocks, which is going to be sand. It's going to be the sand bridge. Alright, so this is pretty cool because when this updates, it could fall on somebody like a troll, like on my last video. Check that video out because it's a very similar process using anvils. But this here is pretty cool, guys. We now have the world's first floating bridge. Maybe not the first. Maybe not the second. We don't really know the numbers, guys. But as you can see, it's sand in the sky. If you put a pressure plate on there, it will fall down. And guys, look at that. It's just floating there. So if I touch it, it will fall. Which is astounding. Pretty good. If you guys enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe and share the money. Sh hang on, share the video with the world and watch all of my other videos today, tomorrow. Thanks, guys.